what you saw just a minute ago was the cluster of honeybees in Honey Beehive B. If you've been following the website, you know I lost Honey Beehive A, which was here. And the last episode, I was talking about how I'm building a top bar hive. And I want to show you why I started this journey with bees three years ago and why it's very important to continue the journey with bees and what I have waiting for new bees come the right springtime. here we have two kiwi plants these are female plants that will grow cover. up this entire arbor within a couple of years here is the uh, other female kiwi plant that arbor took me uh, just a little more than a day to build and finally put into place I have a couple final touches I want to put in this but this thing is rock solid it's in the ground two feet it's cemented and it's not going anywhere and will support up to 300 pounds of kiwi but more importantly in the big picture of things the kiwi are one part of the landscape here we've got great plants in the ground now that are going to be coming up soon and we have all of our elderberry blueberry more hugel culture beds here more grape plants we got all the blackberry the raspberry the green cranberry and uh, some other things into those swells to cover them all up with some nice ground cover and make it a truly edible landscape and as such I need more bees. 